welcome to Snobby Tutorials. In this video, we will dive into managing deal loss reasons and reviewing deal statistics. Among their many wins, sales reps inevitably lose some deals, but as the saying goes, sometimes you need to lose to win again. This is why we believe that our handy deal loss reason feature will help you benefit from the deals you lose and increase the number of the deals you win. By keeping track of your deal loss reasons, you will understand why your customers wasn't ready to close the deal and what needs to be improved to meet customer expectations in the future. Now let's see how you can turn on, apply and add new deal loss reasons in your CRM pipeline. On your pipeline page, click on the gear icon in the upper right corner, find the last stage of your pipeline by scrolling right and enable the deal loss reasons option. Here you can add new deal loss reasons that best suit your business case and remove the unnecessary ones. Just remember, the changes to deal loss reasons made in one pipeline will apply to all of your pipelines. If you're a teamwork user, only your team leader can edit the pipelines and add deal loss reasons. After you enable the deal loss reasons feature, you will be able to select matching reasons and add detailed comments when moving deals to the loss stage. There are three ways of doing this. First, you can go to any specific deal and change its status to lost. You can drag and drop any deal to the lost stage from a pipeline page. Or you can select multiple deals in the list view and move them to the lost stage. But please note, when using this method of moving deals, you won't be able to add a comment. After selecting the lost reason for a specific deal, you will see it in a deal status. You will also see the graph with the most common reasons behind your lost deals in the deal statistics. Statistics help optimize your sales performance and guide your decision making to build a profitable business strategy. It's only natural that our CRM has a statistics summary for you to analyze your work results based on the history of your deals. This report includes the number of deals created and won over a period of time the total value of wine deals, the performance of each team member, and deal loss reasons. Here's how you can access the deal statistics. In the left side menu, hover your cursor over the CRM tab and click Statistics. You will be taken to the deal statistics page where you will see the following metric for you to track. Deals created, deals won, value, team statistics, and deal loss reasons. The toolbar at the top of the deal statistics page allows you to filter statistics by time, pipeline, and team member. If you set a time filter, statistics will be displayed specifically per chosen time period. If you have several pipelines, you can use statistics for all pipelines altogether or choose a specific one. This will help you determine which pipelines perform better and which sales approach works best for your audience. If you use Navia CRM in a team, you can filter your statistics to monitor the progress of a particular team member. The graph in the bottom right corner shows you the most common reasons behind your lost deals. Hovering over the graph shows you a full list of deal loss reasons and the number of deals lost for each reason. Manage your deal loss reasons in just a few clicks and easily monitor your deal statistics to keep track of your success. Don't forget to check our next video on how to create tasks for your deals and stay productive. Like, subscribe and hit the notification bell to be the first to know about our latest features and updates. See you!